might you, out of the blue or any time, envision that the finish of our universe may be the start of the accompanying one, maybe one that is through and through one of a kind practically identical to our own. Speculations of the multiverse are the same old thing to humanity or stargazing. Anyway, confirmation for this hypothesis is arising. The James Webb Space Telescope has as of late conveyed the primary picture of another universe. Since the earliest long stretches of recorded history, individuals have gazed toward the stars and contemplated the sun, the moon, and the stars. For the earliest individuals, the sun and the moon were openings above through which light came into a world that these individuals envisioned as a plate. More than many years, our species has found that we live on a ball that turns and bends around a star, which is besides a piece of a genuinely tremendous number of different stars and planets. We are a little piece of a gigantic universe and an essentially more prominent universe. Regardless of the truth that we have had areas of strength for around 100 years, we still have close to zero insight into space. Specialists are continually finding extra attributes in the universe. They track down replies to old questions, yet different secrets remain. As of not very far in the past, we didn't have any sign who made the universe or why. We didn't be aware as of recently whether the universe has an end or is ceaseless. With our best telescopes, we have so far been able to see around 13.3 billion light years away. When we look, we are continually thinking back in time, since the light that telescopes like Hubble get has headed out through time to contact us. We see the picture existing independently from the wide range of other things at the point when the light began its excursion to us. This assessment of the past is entrancing. Likewise, specialists had the opportunity to review nearly to the origin of the universe, or so they thought, until James Webb, the new space telescope from NASA, the Canadian Space Agency, and the European Space Office, ESA, started its activity in the late spring of 2022. Even the first picture from the telescope gave sensitive material that ignited warmed conversations among researchers. To be exact, there are six universes that ought to have existed toward the start of mankind, for which there is no glaring reason. Frameworks like Glass Z13 existed 250 to 350 million years after the Big Bang, and that is speculatively amazing. At this particular moment, there ought to have been a few stars logically meeting up to form whole universes, and several billion years would be vital. What does this mean? Is the hypothesis of the Big Bang wrong? Or is there a totally novel explanation? Without a doubt, there is one. We could be checking one more universe out here. The picture of the framework Bunchmax J0647 plus 75 uncovers a staggering perspective on a variety of frameworks like significant pearls shimmering in the endlessness of space. What really invigorates researchers about this picture isn't simply its magnificence. In any case, the facts, this same locale of the universe was at that point imaged 10 years prior by the Hubble Space Telescope. Anyway, the nature of the picture wasn't very as significant, and specifically, the old and tanned objects in the background couldn't be decoded. It was just certain that they existed, and that was odd enough. The gravitational lensing effect, where little and far-off objects behind the scenes are intensified by objects in front, let specialists know that these far-off characteristics of light were old and very old, for sure. James Webb then, at that point, uncovered dazzling new subtleties in light of the triple lensing effect. The universe is so old, so splendid, and so profoundly coordinated that our Milky Way appears fairly normal in comparison. Today, specialists are especially baffled by the information on splendor. Assuming that the understandings are right, these universes have delivered a lot more stars than our galaxy. All the standards of cosmology might be imperfect. Maybe researchers have fabricated all cosmological models around a supposition that is now obviously deceptive. This is a shock for the people who had faith in the presence of a solitary universe and anticipated that everything inside this universe could be made sense of with the standards of Einstein's hypothesis of relativity. In the meantime, different parts of physical science have long suggested that it's generally more conceivable for us to live in a universe that is only one of numerous, with different additional aspects or universes that could exist close by or indeed even inside our own reality. These frameworks could challenge our ongoing thoughts as they have a place with an entirely unexpected universe and exist within a totally different time structure. One of the main newfound frameworks was Glass Z12. Universes are normally named after the perception structures through which they are tracked down. Glass refers to gravitational lensing, exact redshift estimation, 
and Z12 demonstrates the worth of the redshift. Each perception bunch utilizes a to some degree different naming plan. The redshift worth of a newfound universe isn't compulsory. Universes can likewise get clear mathematical tasks to lay individuals. Z12 may sound average, yet cosmologists pause their breathing with this assignment. This worth means the framework existed 300 to 400 million years later, the Big Bang, so it's for sure old. As indicated by current cosmological hypotheses, this is apparently incomprehensible. The disclosure of Glass Z12 was at that point celebrated as a sensation in the academic community. However, considerably more antiquated and charming systems followed. The universe candidate CRS 93316 appears to top all the irregularities. This article is so old that it existed just 250 million years after the Big Bang. Anyway, this article shows another idiosyncrasy. Estimations of redshift yielded two extremely surprising results. At one point, the item showed a redshift of 16.7 Z, showing outrageous maturity. Then estimations of adjacent items to CRS 93316 were taken, and in light of those, the universe showed an altogether different redshift. The universe seemed to exist in two spots and two times simultaneously. Researchers vigorously allude to the framework as Schrödinger's universe, enlivened by the renowned quantum physicist Erwin Schrödinger, who demonstrated that at the quantum level, beyond what one reality can exist at the same time. As indicated by these speculations, it's not just imaginable to have two universes. There could be potentially unending more in various and boundless structures. Researchers hooking with these estimation results might in any case want to put stock in an estimation mistake or even question whether these places of light are universes by any means. While the spectroscopy evaluation to affirm the redshift is as yet progressing, further information examination from James Webb's IR camera framework has now totally precluded its opportunity being a young star or a concealed dynamic infinite center. We ought to think about that the disclosure of CRS 93316 was just the start of what is conceivable. NASA has proposed that the James Webb Space Telescope could possibly recognize universes with a redshift more prominent than 20. These universes would have existed just 200 million years after the Big Bang. Or maybe the telescope is looking a lot further into portions of our universe, which could insist that we have experienced a limit of presence unimportant to the Big Bang. At this point, we can never again discuss the start of humanity, the universe, or the time after the Big Bang. Rather, we change the phrasing and allude to it as the edge of the detectable universe. There lies one more interesting wellspring of light that shows an especially high redshift esteem in our pictures. This shows that world 2744Y1 is without a doubt a universe whose light has voyaged more than 13 billion years to contact us. A gathering of analysts has consolidated the best telescopes in the world, the Spitzer Telescope, Tundra, and Hubble, to catch a new picture of this amazing system by gathering information from various frequencies of light and consolidating them into one picture. Not exclusively is the age and distance of this world captivating, but the pace of star arrangement outperforms anything recently remembered to be conceivable in material science. In spite of being a few times more youthful than our Milky Way Universe 2744Y1 produces stars at a rate that is a few times quicker than that of the Milky Way, which is surprising for a galaxy in a youthful universe. The detectable universe now has a span of 46.1 billion light years. Beyond that, there is probably substantially more. The better our instruments become, the further and more itemized our perceptions can reach. James Webb is hypothetically prepared to do thinking back 13.6 billion years. If the Big Bang happened 13.8 billion years ago, there would ultimately be a cutoff to our perceptions, on the grounds that a couple hundred years after the Big Bang, the universe would have been totally dull. The first stars are accepted to have framed as it were following 380,000 years. If space experts keep on finding significantly more established cosmic systems, it will without a doubt show that all past cosmological suspicions were mixed up. Right now, researchers at NASA are acquiring introductory bits of knowledge with the new telescope, which have proactively been amazing. Anyway, we know that time by and large brings new bits of knowledge, and in a couple of years, analysts could really extract even more from the telescope's capacities. Maybe we could at long last see what, truth be told, occurred at the supposed start of time. Albeit the hypothesis of the Big Bang appeared to be conceivable for a period, there was no proof to help its exactness. With the ascent of quantum physical science, 
it became on a very basic level more probable that our universe is an amazingly assorted and possibly intricate spot. Models of the bubble universe or pocket universe recommend that our universe is encased in an enormous air pocket and shares space with a horde of various air pockets of shifting sizes. The pocket universe places that inside a universe there are different parts where comparable yet additionally unique conditions might get through. These pockets could give admittance to various perspectives or corners of the universe where various standards apply. There is likewise a huge measure of proof and hints for these speculations, as there are for the Big Bang hypothesis. The speculations of the Big Bang and the standards of Einstein's physical science were laid out some time before the hypotheses of quantum material science. In the future, the coordination of these models could prompt a more profound comprehension of our universe and the multiverse. If this ends up being valid, then we may be living in an air pocket universe encompassed by different air pockets, or there could be a boundless number of universes, each with its own arrangement of actual regulations. This would propose a degree of intricacy that goes a long way past our current comprehension of the universe and our place inside it. As we proceed to investigate and uncover new information, the plausibility of finding elective universes and points of view becomes progressively conceivable, possibly reshaping our comprehension. We may decipher reality itself in another light. Diving further into the ramifications of these new galactic disclosures, we want to investigate the more extensive inquiries they raise about our universe and our place inside it. Maybe one of the fundamental questions is whether the universe we perceive exists, or on the other hand if our observations just uncover a much bigger and more perplexing design. The probability of a multiverse that different, potentially huge universes exist past our own, has gotten some decent forward movement in both hypothetical material science and cosmology. On the off chance that the new disclosures made by the James Webb Space Telescope suggest the presence of universes that oppose current understanding, it could demonstrate that our universe is only one piece of a much more amazing endless woven artwork. The multiverse hypothesis itself comes in different structures, each with various ramifications for how we could decipher reality. One is the inflationary two exceptional hypothesis multiverse, which recommends that during the early snapshots of the Big Bang, different districts of space extended at various rates. This lopsided development may have prompted the formation of unmistakable bubble universes, each with its own set of actual regulations and constants. If this hypothesis holds, the universe we see may be only one air pocket in a tremendous different foam. Another charming idea is the probability of a cyclic universe. This hypothesis proposes that the universe goes through an immortal pattern of creation, development, withdrawal, and resurrection. As indicated by this model, the universe as we realize it very well may be the consequence of a past universe imploding in on itself and afterward reappearing in an enormous detonation-like occasion. This cycle might actually rehash endlessly, giving one approach to propose that our universe cycles through an endless series of inestimable resurrections. The disclosure of incredibly old systems like Glass Z12 and CRS 93316 postures critical difficulties to our current comprehension of enormous advancement. These revelations propose that there would be able to have been processes happening in the early universe that we don't yet completely understand. If cosmic systems could frame and arrange themselves so rapidly after the Big Bang, it infers that our models of astronomical development and design arrangement may require critical amendments. This disclosure could prompt new hypotheses about how systems and other enormous structures create and connect over time. Moreover, the chance of experiencing abnormalities that appear to go against standard models of physical science makes the way for a reassessment of key standards. For instance, the presence of universes with properties that challenge how we might interpret dark matter, dark energy, and the way of behaving of light might at some point require an update of the standard model of particle physics. This could likewise provoke a re-examination of Einstein's hypothesis of relativity and how it applies on the most amazing scales. As we keep on pushing the limits of our observational capacities, the role of future space missions and progressed telescopes will be crucial. Instruments that are significantly more remarkable than the James Webb Space Telescope will be required to test further into the universe and possibly recognize much more far-off or faint items. These headways will assist with refining how we might interpret the universe's set of experiences and design and may give further bits of knowledge into the valid nature of the universe. Also, the philosophical and existential ramifications of these revelations are significant. If our universe is important for a multiverse, 
Or, on the other hand, if there are domains past our ongoing observational cutoff points, it challenges our exceptionally comprehension of presence. This could influence not just logical speculations, but also our philosophical and otherworldly viewpoints on life, awareness, and the idea of reality. As we disentangle more about the universe, we could get ourselves reconsidering essential inquiries regarding the significance and reason for our reality. In summary, the new bits of knowledge acquired from the James Webb Space Telescope and other high-level observational instruments are growing our insight into the universe in manners we had not expected. These disclosures are not just adding new parts of the infinite riddle but are fundamentally reshaping our comprehension of the universe. As we proceed to investigate and learn, we stand near the precarious edge of possibly earth-shattering disclosures that could change our impression of reality itself. The excursion to figuring out the real essence of the universe is not even close to finished, and each new disclosure brings us one stage closer to unwinding the mysteries of existence. Sure. The concept of the universe's end possibly marking the beginning of another has intrigued thinkers for ages. The multiverse theory suggests that our universe might be just one of countless others, a notion that has gained traction with recent discoveries. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, launched in 2021, is providing new insights that challenge our understanding of cosmology. For centuries, humans have looked to the stars evolving from ancient beliefs of a flat Earth with lights above to a more complex understanding of a spherical planet orbiting a star within a vast universe filled with countless galaxies. Despite over a century of astronomical advancements, our knowledge of the cosmos remains limited. The JWST has recently captured images of ancient galaxies, prompting discussions about their implications on the Big Bang theory. The Big Bang is thought to be the universe's origin and recent findings suggest galaxies like Glass Z13 existed far earlier than previously believed, only 250 to 350 million years post-Big Bang. This raises questions about the validity of the Big Bang theory itself. The JWST has produced images of galaxy clusters, revealing structures that were harder to interpret with earlier telescopes. Gravitational lensing has allowed scientists to observe distant galaxies in unprecedented detail, with some exhibiting star formation rates much higher than those in our Milky Way. New discoveries, such as Glass Z12 and the exceptionally ancient CRS 93316, challenge the very foundations of our cosmological models. CRS 93316, showing signs of existing in two different redshift states, hints at the possibility of multiple realities coexisting. This leads to the idea of a multiverse where distinct physical laws could apply. The ongoing research with JWST opens up the potential to discover galaxies with even greater redshift values, suggesting that our understanding of cosmic history may need revision. If these ancient galaxies formed earlier than theorized, it could indicate that processes we don't fully grasp were at work in the early universe. The implications of these findings extend into theoretical physics, prompting the need to reconsider current models, including the Big Bang hypothesis and Einstein's theories. The possibility of cyclic universes and inflationary multiverse theories introduces the notion that our universe could be just one of many, with distinct characteristics and histories. As we enhance our observational technology, including future telescopes, we can expect even deeper insights into the cosmos. These advancements not only reshape our scientific knowledge but also provoke philosophical inquiries about our existence, purpose, and the nature of reality itself. As each new discovery unfolds, it propels us closer to uncovering the profound mysteries that lie beyond our current comprehension of the universe.